That's good. Hi, I'm Paul Vitti, writer and director of Lipstick and Scones on at Space on the Royal Mile 510 every day. And I've just seen Wrestling Mania. Um, thoroughly enjoyed it. Has the award for me for most controversially brilliant joke, which I'm not going to repeat because I'll get arrested, but I'll tell the guys afterwards. Um, slightly off the beaten track, but literally in the shadow of the castle. I, I really enjoyed it. Um, it's, it's a fun uh, show that you don't need to know anything about wrestling to enjoy. And I'll let some of the guys in the cast tell you about it. How did it come uh, about? <laughs> wrestling Money, it was written by a director. He plays the character of John, who's kind of the lead role in it. It is a show where everything that can go wrong does go wrong. As if you don't even have action enough wrestlers to do the show, it's three wrestlers just trying to put on a 20 man rumble and just do everything to save the show, even though they just can't be honest. Yeah, so, uh, so Alex and his mate, one of his friends from uni, Ben, they started writing it about three years ago. Uh, and they, they sort of three years ago, and I really like them. They changed each other for the rest of it. They just did they approached the first individual who saw it about six months ago and said, Hi, we're taking a show to the fringe, do you want to come be in it? Uh, and that's, that's how we all got involved, isn't it? I play the character of Phil. Uh, I'm the, the stage manager who is just absolutely sick of everything that is happening because <laughs> And I'm the Mark, the cocky, ballsy dick, basically. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's lots that I think wrestling fans would recognise of some of the yeah. things that are wrong with wrestling as well as right. How did the director persuade you to wear some of the outfits? The outfits in it are <laughs> worth coming for alone because they're very funny and brilliant. Yeah, you can't yeah. really explain he, the costumes. Did, he, did just... he get you drunk one night and you agreed to that <laughs> outfit or? It was kind yeah. of in the rehearsal process, wasn't it? We come in in our normal clothes and they're like, Roy, um, we need you to look slightly more like yeah. wrestlers. Each rehearsal so... just got less and less <laughs> clothes. Yeah. So we had jeans, yeah. then shorts, then boxers, then speedos, and then you have to come and see it for the last one. Yeah, yeah. 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 there's some there's some, some very interesting outfits in it, which which you've got to come and see and see. And it's not just boys, it's a very talented actress in it as yep. well. Um, her name is Caitlin, she plays the character of Becky, who is the kind of bolshy woman who really doesn't she's a tomboy, isn't she? And she just and probably hates the best John. natural wrestler within the show. <laughs> yeah, she absolutely hates so, John. Where is it? What time's it on guys? Wrestling Mania on the Super Mario Club, uh, which is here. Uh, right by the end of the castle. Every day until the 18th of August. Please do do come and catch us out. Can't let them. Oh, fuck up. You can do that. <laughs> you catch, can come, and come and watch, watch the show, please. <laughs> it's also part of the free fringe. Yes, it is. Yeah. So, yeah. It is. And it's, uh, don't be confused when you arrive because um, let me show you. This 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 is the venue, right? And you wander in, expecting a box office. There's there's sort of. Not really anyone there. Work your way upstairs and just walk in. Just okay? look at the guy in the yeah. speedos. Yeah. <laughs> Follow the sound of the laughter up bar. the stairs. There's a bar there, um, and you pay what you feel on the way out. And yeah. I reached in my pocket for notes. I'm sure you will. If you can, get along and see it. <laughs>